Welcome to the channel, Farm with Nick. Thank you so much for joining me right now on the farm. I am actually looking at purchasing some equipment for our uh, cattle. So first, we need something to take water to their pens. So I really like this one. Um, but you can see it holds 6,000 liters. Um, and I know we're going to get more cattle. So, and I know <laughs> this one, you can just see. Um, yeah, and it's only three slots too. It's hard to pass off on the price on this tank. So, I'm actually going to cheat a little bit here and get this uh, lizard tank here. And let's switch the colors and make it look more like a tank I would use. There we go. That's better. So even though it's small, but it'll, it'll save me time in the long run trying to fill up and wait there. So let's do that. And they can always change that one out which I might, I might go for a bigger tank just to make it look <laughs> a little more realistic. And let's go up to, um, we need a manure spreader coming up here. And typically I just use one of these base game ones and I've used this one before. I've used some of these other ones down here. Yeah, I've used this one as well and that holds nine meters this one holds 15.6 so as you can see our balance we're doing pretty good um i know it's tempting to go with this one it only holds nine nine point five and i could just buy it outright for thirty thousand um but i would definitely upgrade it um to something else here that holds more I mean, these are, you know, going double. So, I know I like this one. I've used that one a lot. So, I'm going to play it safe for right now. And, oh, we only get two options red and red too. They look about the same, just slightly different tint. So, let's do this one. And that'll probably be upgraded eventually. And then we also need a slurry tank. All right. So for this, let's see. Typically, same thing. I run a lot of these base game ones. But still, these are expensive. And yeah, one uh, series, I did run this one. Very cool slurry tank. Um, but I got some mods on, and I got these. And I think you need an extra, yeah, the sprayer attachments for these. So I actually like like one of these that has three wheels on. I think these look so cool. Um, just looks really cool. However, yeah, 96,000. I don't know if I want to do that. And maybe this one, because I know our wheat field should be ready soon. Um, the corn, I think it's ready if I used it for chaff, which I really do want to do that and start fermenting. And that's my plan with our other field. So. I guess yeah, let's just do it. If I have to take out a loan, that's okay. All right, so let's go down. I actually want to change. I'll leave everything. Um, I won't change it, but I want to get the color. I think you can go only two. Hmm. Thought you could do black with one of them. Maybe not. If I just go red then. 
Yeah, let's do that. I like the red better than the the orange. Oops. And I don't know. Yeah. I will see. Okay. Let's leave everything else the same. Extension. Another 2,000. Let's keep it the same. Um, could always customize it later once I kind of get used to it. If I've never actually used one of these. Um, it just looked really cool. And I was like, oh, I gotta try it. So, there we go. Great reason. So, probably need a spray. And... 12 meters, 8, 16. But let's just keep it a little simple. Let's go for the double. And we'll do that too. Okay. All right. So a lot of equipment over there. So I'm going to hop up in the pickup. And I'll meet you back at the... Uh, the store once I'm there kind of look at everything and I know I'm going to have to take more than a couple trips going back and forth just to even get it all over here at the farm so I'll see you uh, back at the store though in a little bit okay so we are over here at the store now and you can see our new equipment here so I'm just going to start Oh, uh-oh. <laughs> I'm going to start um, taking these back. I think this should... Oh, there it is. This should let me take... Yep, our water tank back. There we go. And then you can see the other ones obviously have PTO, so I'm going to have to bring out um, a couple tractors and uh, get those and take them back. All right. So I'll start with this first. Bring a couple tractors out uh, and I'll kind of make my way back to the farm. So once I get all those back, um, I'll bring you guys back and uh, after that we can finally get going with our cattle. Um, I do need to feed them, kind of running low on their, their food and now they have a water tank. We'll be all set there and um, pretty soon you know I'm kind of like speeding up a time a little bit just so I can get a little more funds again and uh, get our fields harvested so then I can um, uh, get going with our cattle with uh, maybe getting some uh, chaff going and also getting our um, can't think of it well I'll think of it later I guess so I'll see you back at the farm when I get everything over there okay so got our second tractor down here at the store now we got one down here the 7R already I hooked it up to the slurry tank and then you can see in the back of that slurry tank I uh, connected it real quick up to the the double hose there that'll help distribute it so that's all ready to go back now to the farm and then we have our manure tank or sorry manure spreader right here and then this will be ready to take back as well I don't know if I can back up correctly there we go Yep, so we're all set. So I'll start with this one, and then I'll come back and grab that slurry one. And this manure spreader looks smaller than anything I'm really used to, or really played with on the game, but financially, I just don't want to lease any more equipment. I mean, we have quite a bit of equipment leased, um, and every month, if I, you know, skip ahead a little bit, take a huge, you know, like, 
at least 10,000, if not a little bit more financially. So eventually um, my goal would be to actually own all that equipment too. But in time, it's just taken, taken a little bit and I actually want to get some other farms and buy some other property here soon that I've been scoping out. So, all right, let me get this uh, back to the farm and I'll get that other tractor as well and I'll meet you there. Okay, we are just pulling up to our farm here. We have our second tractor with our slurry tank now. And I'll pull in. So I have the other two parked up front just so you can see them again. And just kind of showcase them real fast. So we have our water tank right there with our uh, Silverado pickup. Then we have our manure one. And then last we have our slurry tank, which is a mod that I picked up. I just thought they looked really cool. So we'll see how it works out. So there we go, some new equipment on the farm. And uh, can't wait to start using it. And see where it goes um hopefully i don't have to upgrade it right away can use it for a while and then i'll probably as we increase cattle and um, need more efficient equipment just for larger purposes then i'll probably look at upgrading them but for right now i think uh that'll be a great start so i'll actually uh stop the video right there and it might be one of our shorter videos for the series but in real time uh it took quite a while driving to and from uh the store there and would have been one of the longer videos just watching me drive back and forth so thank you uh so much for joining me and uh hope you have a good one take care